show. Today we're talking about a draffinil. Okay, so just a brief overview of a draffinil. Basically, this is the first synthetic nootropic uh, in that modafinil, adrafinil, armadafinil class. They're all related structurally, but they're slightly different. And adrafinil was the first one. Now, it's used to promote um, alertness and concentration, and it's a great tool for preventing fatigue, but some people consider it to be not as safe or not as useful because adrafinil basically gets converted into adrafinil in the liver, or sorry, adrafinil gets converted into modafinil in the liver. And people think that the conversion in the liver is actually dangerous for your body because it's just more work that you have to do. And some people consider it to be a, a drug that works slower or less effectively than modafinil, but that'll be for you to decide. So the benefits of adrafinil are First and foremost, it gets converted into modafinil in the liver so that you can use modafinil as a psychoactive compound. Now, modafinil has many effects for your cognition. Namely, it's used as a great drug for uh, attention deficit disorder. Studies show that a similar amount of uh, modafinil and um, by proxy, adrafinil, can be used in order to treat ADD compared to something like an amphetamine, like Adderall or something like that. So, um, the, but the, the benefit is, instead of just being a concentration enhancer like Adderall, it's also a mood enhancer, but without the change in addiction potential. So you can actually take modafinil or adrafinil and feel better uh, mood and have better focus, but not get addicted as easily as with Adderall, which is an amphetamine-based product. Now, in a lot of studies with modafinil, they focus on sleep deprivation, and they try to uh, see whether it's possible to improve cognitive abilities when sleep deprived. One study actually showed that they could uh, have soldiers or pilots in the U.S. Air Force that went 64 straight hours without sleep, and modafinil was able to um, have the same effects on their uh, working memory and their um, cognition as something like Adderall or amphetamine. And so even in extreme sleep deprivation states, it's possible to get similar benefits from both. Now, for one thing, people can sit, complain about the liver function, but there's actually a lot of Reddit people who discuss Adrafinil from that perspective, and one of whom actually did the entire test for six weeks with liver function um, exams and found that a lower dosage of Adrafinil didn't have any effects on his liver. So it's possible that you can use Adrafinil without any kind of liver side effects. Other than the, the side effects with your liver for adrafinil, there's the side effects that you're going to experience whether you take adrafinil, armadafinil, or modafinil. Um, and they're not the same for everybody, but some people have irritability, anxiety, and if you take it too late in the day, it can be really hard to fall asleep. Now, something that's very bizarre that happened to me is I actually have a histaminergic interaction with these drugs, which means that I get kind of congested for a few days when I take modafinil. Now, to me, it's worth the trade-off, a little bit of congestion to be able to focus and, and do better work, but it might not be for you, so just keep that in mind. If you are going to get a Drafnil, what we recommend is you get the Pure Nootropics Drafnil. Uh, like I said, this is a vendor that has um, a lot of safety precautions in mind, one of which is uh, third-party testing on their products. and. This adrafinil is actually um, the same adrafinil that you could get from anywhere else, like Nootropics Depot. So even though we recommend pure nootropics, you can also get it from Nootropics Depot. And the, the link above will send you to, to one of those sites. But make sure you take a look at all the side effects and everything before you decide to buy it. See you next time.